CompTIA Network Plus N10-009 Practice Exam Questions 96 through 100 This video is part of our practice exam video series and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 96 A network administrator is optimizing data transfers on a high-speed network and needs to enable support for jumbo frames. Which of the following devices would allow this configuration? The answer is D. Switch. Jumbo frames are Ethernet frames larger than the standard 1500 bytes, typically up to 9000 bytes, used to reduce overhead and improve performance in high-speed networks. Network switches that support jumbo frames can process these larger packets efficiently, reducing CPU utilization and increasing data throughput. However, all devices in the network path must also support jumbo frames to avoid fragmentation issues. Question 97. A network manager is deploying a security information and event management system to ensure accurate event correlation across multiple devices. Which of the following protocols is essential for maintaining synchronized timestamps in this scenario? The answer is A. NTP. NTP, or Network Time Protocol, is essential for ensuring that all systems in a network maintain synchronized time. Accurate timekeeping is crucial for log analysis, authentication mechanisms, scheduled tasks, and troubleshooting network issues. Without proper synchronization, logs from different devices can have mismatched timestamps, making it difficult to correlate events, diagnose security incidents, and maintain consistency across distributed systems. Question 98. A network engineer is setting up a secure VPN tunnel between two corporate offices. The tunnel must encrypt all transmitted data to maintain confidentiality. Which of the following protocols should be used to achieve this requirement? The answer is C. ESP. ESP, or Encapsulating Security Payload, is a core protocol in IPsec that provides encryption for data in transit, ensuring confidentiality. It encrypts the payload of IP packets, preventing unauthorized access and protecting sensitive information from interception. ESP can operate in transport mode, securing only the payload or tunnel mode, encrypting the entire packet for VPN use. Question 99. Which of the following routing protocols has an internal administrative distance value of 90? The answer is D. EIGRP. EIGRP, or Enhanced Interior Gateway Routing Protocol, has a default administrative distance of 90 for internal routes. This makes it more preferred than other interior gateway protocols like OSPF and RIP as lower AD values indicate higher trustworthiness in route selection. Question 100. A network engineer receives a security advisory about a newly discovered vulnerability affecting a router's CPU. Which of the following actions should the engineer take to mitigate the issue? The answer is A. Apply a firmware update. Firmware updates are crucial for maintaining the security, stability, and performance of network devices like routers and switches. Manufacturers release updates to patch vulnerabilities, optimize functionality, and introduce new features that enhance network efficiency. Regular updates help mitigate security risks by addressing known exploits and ensuring compatibility with evolving protocols and standards. Keeping firmware current is a key best practice for protecting network infrastructure from potential threats. So, can any of these questions give you a tough time? Don't worry if they did, it's all part of the learning process. Luckily, Certification Synergy has a wealth of free video content at your disposal. To stay connected with our latest IT learning resources, just give a quick click on the subscribe button. This simple action ensures you're always updated about our newest video releases. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.